Oh man, so what's up, bro? How you doing, bro? <laughs> pretty good, pretty good. I know it's been a it's been a few weeks. It's been a hot minute. Yeah, it has been a hot minute. What well, shit's been going on? Look at these guys been working out. Right? Check you them know out. What I'm oh, hot boy, hot boy summer. What's up with these guns? Pew pew pew. Pew pew. It's hot. It's hot. It so is. that's why we're we're dressed down in this attire to. Uh, it's been yeah. hot, bro. It, dude. Right? Yeah. If you guys are in Jersey, it, it was like 90 degrees today at, at work. 96, yeah. I think. Yeah. yeah and you're, you're, it's, it's hot, probably hot there. No, That's insane. why you lost all that weight. Probably. Yeah. I thought you went to Auschwitz, but. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? I'm kidding, my fellow you, Jews. You rescued me. You rescued me, man. <laughs> I did, right? But, uh, I said, don't go in that fucking sauna. I'm too dark to go there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they would have just killed me. Right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Line up against the wall. <laughs> <laughs> but, um. But yeah, man. No, no, no. We've been uh, we've been doing stuff, you know, for through the last uh, three weeks. Yeah, both so. of us. It's been it's been crazy. It has been crazy. But we're but back. Yeah, we're back. Yes, we are. We're back on the mic, ready to talk about some crazy crazy stuff going on this week. Uh, yeah. Topics. Yeah, D uh, <laughs> right? Disney. They're discriminating now against against uh, the white boy summer. Yeah, the white boy summer. <laughs> right. Right. White boy summer. They don't want to hire the white boys anymore. Disney don't like that. Why? I don't know. And I have been noticing this. Every movie from me growing up, mm -hmm. you know, in the, in the, from the 60s, 70s, 80s, Snow White, yeah. uh, Rapunzel, whatever, mm -hmm. all that shit, you know what I mean? They're making new age movies completely different mm -hmm. with, with, you know. Black, Asian. Non-white people. Yeah. Okay, now listen. They're trying to be uh, racially balanced. Racially balanced. Now, part of me, I don't care. Yeah. Part of me is like, you know what? Do what you need to do. Obviously, mm -hmm. if if a little girl sees somebody like her on TV, that that you know could be her hero or yes. she can look up to, fine. However, I honestly feel like the people that they're doing this for really don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? And I think it's just the people that are in control. They're overly being sensitive about things mm -hmm. that 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 nobody's complaining about, and they're like. Forcing it upon everybody, okay. They want to appease everyone. Yeah, like I'll put it this way, right? My son, when Black Panther came out, yeah, obviously he saw a black actor, yep, being a, a black superhero, but just a superhero in general. My son never looked at the <sighs> at the guy's color of skin. No, he just saw it as a black superhero. He, yes, he just yeah. saw another human being uh -huh. being a superhero, and that's what he wanted to be. And it was normal. A superhero. Yes. He didn't care if it was a black guy, a yeah. white guy, an Asian guy, you know what I'm saying? No, I like hear He you. watches like Bruce Lee movies from but back But you day. know what? You're raising your kid the right way. He's not seeing it as color. That's what I'm saying. I'm, yeah. not, I'm not telling him, oh, it's a black superhero. No, I'm just saying it's a hero. Yeah. Be a hero. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Which is awesome. Yes. That, that's what people need to start doing. Like, yeah. teach your child that just be the hero you need to be. Don't, yeah, don't, like don't. You, can, you can watch a, a white princess or a black princess. It's still a princess. Exactly. Yeah, but the problem is, is the sensitivity in America. Yeah. It's pointed out. I think color is pointed out. To it's some, it's, yeah, to it's, some, it's, it, it is, and it branches so, out from America to other countries through movies and and videos and all that shit. Yeah, absolutely, you know? absolutely, and that's the worst. It is the worst. So I know, so. I know. I mean, look, um, like Star Wars, mm -hmm. right? Growing che up, Chewie with, was black. Right, you're right. <laughs> growing up with the original Star Wars, Darth Vader was black. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But growing up with the original Star Wars, right? Yeah. yeah. Luke Skywalker. That was the story. Yeah. Every boy, no matter what race, religion they were, wanted to be Luke Skywalker. Absolutely. It was okay? about Luke Skywalker. Yes. Now they've completely changed it. They went the whole hardcore female way, which, listen, part of it... They did go hard female. I, I don't mind. They did. But we had they Princess did. Leia. Yeah. Princess and, and, Leia. And we loved her. Yes. Princess you know? Leia was a strong, powerful woman. She was. In the Star Wars yeah. world. She called the shots. She told Han Solo to shut B the fuck Billy, up. Billy D. Williams was in there, too. Yes. Well, you know, with this Coke 45 mustache. Right? Yeah. Exactly. And he was important. He was important. He was even in the, in the new ones. Uh, Favreau made The uh, Mandalorian. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Which is a, a guy's movie. Exactly. But it's also awesome for women, too. Yeah. So. I just think that they're um, very over, over, overly sensitive and, and sensitizing everything so much that uh, people are just fed up, man. So you do know? you think it's like a level of like racism on their 
part. Like they are there. It's like kind of like yeah. they're pushing, you know, they're trying something to be anti- too hard. They're trying to be so anti-racist that they're actually being racist. I got gotcha. you. You know, okay. they're, they might they might not be being racist towards, say, say like people of color, mm-hmm. but they're definitely racist towards white people. Now we saw a video of a gentleman. Yes. What, did he was he a Disney employee or? I'm assuming. Um, I, you know, I'll post the video. Certainly, there have been times where you know they, there's no way we're hiring a white male. Just kind of, it's, yeah. Unspoken. Uh, there are times when it's spoken, but how would they say it? There's no way we're hiring a white male. Which we'll Say like straight to you yeah. or okay yeah. they'd be very careful how they message that to agents so yeah there's a video of i'm assuming it's a it's a disney employee mm-hmm. whistleblower so to say and he's incognito at a restaurant talking to somebody mm-hmm. and he's explaining to them that disney does not want white people in any position they, they, yeah they want to yeah, yeah they want to hire people that are not white yes and he also explained that there was a person that had a good position that they wouldn't promote because they were half black, half white, but they were more on the lighter skin color. So they were like, no, no. he's not black enough. We wanted to hire somebody in the department a few years ago now um, who was half black, but didn't like appear half black. And um, there was a creative executive who was like, we're not, like, that's not, that's not what's going Like, they wanted somebody in meetings who would appear a certain way, and he wasn't gonna, gonna bring that to the meeting. I mean, it kind of feels like we're, you know, at some point there's going to be a lawsuit. That's kind of how it feels, just because of, you know. Yeah. You know, now, a part of me is like, listen. <sighs> Whatever happened to the best person? That's what I'm saying. But like, black people should think of that as a smack to the face, because, if you're getting the job just because of your skin color, do you feel good about that? Mm-hmm. Or do you feel like, you know, like, uh, you know, you're the mentally challenged person getting the job because everybody feels sorry for you? Yeah, I mean, it depends. These companies, they're, they have to have a certain amount of uh, color colors. And I think that's people. bad, too. You have to have, like, and I'm just going to say it, a certain amount of Asians, yes. a certain amount of blacks. Yes. They have to cover, like, there's... There's something like, it's like an unwritten thing, but they want to make sure that they're diversified. That's the problem, okay? The whole word di- diversity mm-hmm. is the problem. If, if you have four guys and girls, right? Mm-hmm. So you have two guys, two girls, right? You have a, a white guy, a black guy, say, uh, uh, you know, Asian female, and then you mm-hmm. have uh, like a Spanish man. Woman? Right? Okay. Or a man, all right? Yeah. I feel like... You shouldn't choose somebody because of their race, religion, or color of skin. Uh, but that's what it comes down to nowadays. Yes. And that's why I think the, the, everything that's sucks. That's a deciding factor on a, lot, on a lot of things. Like if it's an all-male staff yeah. and there's another male that's strong and should be hired, they will purposely be like, no, we're hiring a female, we're hiring a black female, we're hiring a Spanish female, we're hiring an Indian woman, yeah. we're hiring an Asian man. Uh, they, they have to... There's definitely a level of, I guess you could call it like racism. I mean, it's almost like that Seinfeld but episode it's, yeah. where the restaurant only hired big breasted women. Yeah. <laughs> right? And Elaine was pissed off. You got to put that clip up. Yeah. yeah. And Elaine was yeah. pissed Elaine off. Elaine was upset she about it. Big boobs, she didn't have big boobs. She tried to go for the job. Yeah. And yep. he wouldn't hire her. He wouldn't hire her. Right, because you're That's not going to bring into business. Yeah, right? exactly. Yeah. Exactly. This isn't the itty bitty titty community. It's Hooters. <laughs> but yeah. No, but exactly. it's true. It's true. Nowadays, I think they look at that. They're not necessarily picking the strongest person. No. They're picking the, uh, just so, you know, there's no problems down the road. Yeah, yeah. But Disney went far into it. Far where into where it. Where even if that guy, the, the, the half, half black, half white guy was super qualified for the job, uh, he didn't get it because he was just too, on the, too much on the white too side. Too white. Yeah. 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 So it's almost like that, um, that uh, uh, Family Guy episode where the cop holds up the, uh, the color chart. Yeah. To the uh, driver yeah. of the car. To yeah. See, you know, ha- to what, see where what, he falls. Exactly. Yeah. That's what Disney's doing now yeah. to their employees. Now, a part of me sees the video. I think it's like this across the board, though. I think it is, too. I think it is, well, too. It's an unwritten rule in, in, the, in America now. Like, I've gotten in a fight with my, my wife because as an auto mechanic mm-hmm. in my facility, I have a lot of raunchy dudes. I don't want to hire females. 
Because then these raunchy dudes might say the wrong thing, and then who mm. the fuck is getting sued? Me. Exactly. Right? So I don't I don't do that because number one, I don't want any sexual harassment stuff. No, I don't you. want anything, uh, you know, coming back at me for anything stupid that I don't even do. Mm. You, know what you I'm just saying? don't want to deal with the backlash of that. <laughs> yeah, like I might you know? look at you it, it, wrong. You yeah. know what I mean? And God forbid you think I'm looking at you sexually, and yeah. then there it is. Yeah. Next thing I know, I'm yeah. in fucking court losing my family because because I looked at you in a weird yeah. way. You get what I'm saying? No, I understand. I understand. So uh, that's I mean that's one of the reasons why I won't hire females in that scenario. I mean, a lot mm. of these guys they still have the old Snap-on posters with naked women on their backs. Yeah, box. yeah, no, that no, I know. You know what I'm I saying? Know, yeah. That's why another thing I don't let customers in the base. It's like a, it's like a, a men's locker room a little bit. It's Pretty much. It's tough to break. That's a tough industry. You for You have women. to have a strong mindset and not be sensitive at all to be in auto mechanics. Yeah. Because we talk shit to each other. Oh, 100%. You know, I mean, yeah. it's like, the, yeah, it's like it's locker a men's room. locker room. Exactly. Yeah. You know? I mean, so. I, I'll tell a guy that, you know, if he can't do something, do I got to go home and fuck his wife or girlfriend for yeah. him? Because <laughs> you, you can't you know? say that to yeah. your female you employee. You can't say that to a female no, employee, no, right? You can't. Do I got to come over and huck twa your boyfriend? <laughs> 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 because you ain't doing that yeah. shit. Yeah, no, no, yeah, I hear exactly. you. That's funny, huck twa. That's what's popular. It is popular. Yeah. We got to talk about that in another episode. Yeah, we should. But, um, we should. But, yeah, but, you know, with that video, too, uh, about Disney, mm -hmm. a part of me is up in the air with it. Why? Because when you first see the video, you're like, oh, fuck Disney, right? Yeah. But then as the guy's talking, we did see a, a um, black person walk behind him. Uh-huh. You know, give him a look. And I, I don't know if, if it was a, a server. Yeah, God forbid you talk about color if people get it. You, you know, know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But... Yeah. He's in a restaurant drinking wine, and he's being kind of loud. He talking. was loud. So I'm like, if you're whistleblowing, wouldn't you want to be incognito? A little more incognito, right? yeah. Because you never know when the Mickey Mouse is behind no. you, ready to fucking cap you. Yeah. Like Boeing did to their whistleblower. Yeah, yeah they did. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They did cap him. Exactly. Right before yes, uh, he the was trial or whatever. The trial. Exactly. He was what? Like, he was young. Yeah. And yeah. Mickey Mouse, man, he'll... You know? Yeah. <laughs> oh, M-I-C, K-E-Y. <laughs> <laughs> no, bro, Disney, there's a lot of conspiracies with Disney. Very, very much conspiracy theories. Yeah. Man. But, um, so that's why part of me is up in the air. Like, was it, is it a real video? Is it a real whistleblower? Or is it just somebody, f almost like fake AI, making this video? <sighs> you know, no nowadays. To get people's... To, you know, get the people's mindset to change and just to go against the company, mm. you know, because anything's possible these days. Anything is possible. You know, one video goes viral, yeah, and, and then, that is it, man. And that is it. You know? You can't stop it. Yeah, can't stop, won't stop, and then just people are, I just think people in general are just fucking stupid these days, and they don't. Well, that, that's a lot to do They don't do research too. and pay no, attention. No, You know? So we can give you an opinion about something, but yeah. if anyone wants a deeper dive. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, deep dive in the video. If you know the video I'm talking about, like I said, I'll post it next. Yeah. Uh, look at it and, and let me know if it's legit. Let me know if you think it's uh, iffy. Uh, let me know what you think about Disney. Did they ruin movies, TV shows, Yeah, series? give us your opinion about Disney. Yeah, yeah. I feel like they, I feel like they ruined definitely 100% Star Wars. Are you Wars. like a Disney guy? Like, do you, have you been to Disney? Oh, yeah, I've been at Disney. Okay. I, mean, I, I enjoyed myself. You take the kids you there know? yet? No, I, I didn't take the kids yet. All right. I went there with the next girlfriend back in the day. You got to do... Uh, and we did go during the... Uh, we have to edit that out? No, no, no. no, no. <laughs> we did go during the uh, Star Wars convention. Oh, which okay. Which was awesome. That's probably cool. But this cool. was like in the early 2000s. With stormtroopers and shit out? Yeah, oh, it was awesome, Walking dude. around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. I, I still got my, my Benoit... Not Benoit. <laughs> Obi-Wan Kenobi and Benoit, nice. Benoit Ball. Yeah, like, Benoit Ball. Uh, the uh, Obi-Wan yeah, Kenobi... playing with the fucking... Right, yeah, yeah. The <laughs> Obi-Wan Kenobi uh, hoodie. Hoodie? Yeah, nice, that's I, I sweet. got the... Uh, the you got a lightsaber? I didn't get a lightsaber. All right, yeah. all right. If I'm going to get a lightsaber, <laughs> shit's going to be fucking We should have had a little battle with we him. We should, yeah. That would yeah. be fun. My Schwartz is bigger than yours. <laughs> <laughs> well, you are Greek. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, but, you know, let us know down below let in the comment section, comment. you know, of uh, what's what, and uh, we'll go from there. Sounds good. You know what I mean?